Well, here we have me making my backy shower with a grinder and a battery drill <clears throat> out of um, old swimming pool poles and a bit of threaded bar. sort of mostly recycled really I did use recycled um, plant pots but um, they went brittle because we live in Spain and the sun if the sun hits something for more than a few months it's uh, it just makes it all brittle and falls apart so I had to buy new pots those pots in the background there are new but the poles are all recycled and the threaded bars recycled and found I had to buy nuts and washers as well they were bought though so sort of half and half I suppose half bought half recycled as you can see, I use my thumb <laughs> and hold it together. I do have a ruler, but uh, a tape measure as well, but I, I sort of do things by eye and I do use the ruler to double check everything. But once I've started making stuff, I sort of put the frame together roughly and then sort of mark it with a marker. And I also, once I've made one, obviously I'll copy them all with a ruler, but the first one I'll do by eye usually. Here my lovely birds in the background there, in my aviary. Obviously going through with a thin drill bit, then going through with a thicker one makes it much easier. Instead of trying to cane it through a one big thick one. And probably uh, drill into my hand at the same time. Uh, here we have the uh, the plastic holes put in the bottom of the troughs. Instead of drilling it, as you can see, they're black. Look, they were the old ones that I'd recycled, but they were too brittle in the end. Instead of drilling it, if it's brittle when you drill it, it just cracks into pieces. So I use a soldering iron. Works an absolute treat. It saves a lot of time, effort, and cracking and hassle and oh, loads of rubbish. And um, there we go with the uh, the the spray bar at the top, just gluing it together. It's really easy. You just buy the corners and fiddle with it and put it all together with the clean it obviously with the cleaner then the glue afterwards. And then uh, once it's all together, I sort of um, didn't drill the holes. I used the soldering iron again to put holes in at different angles, um, and then fiddled with it to get the angle right. There's a bit of glue going on. But I had cleaned it with what's on the cloth, the paper cloth that you can see on the table is a cleaning fluid. It's like um, methylated spirits or something like that. White spirit, I think it is actually. I put it, did put it together and after that's got white, uh, white spirit on that white cloth there. I did put it together wonky actually in the end and I had to heat it all up with the blow torch and straighten it. But that's not in the, in the video. This is my first test of it, as you can see. I put the spray bar on and I put a bit of sponge at the top, a bit of um, floss to take the, the bigger dirt particles. You can see the floss there, better look. That was just with the two trays in, obviously. I've got two more trays to go in there. It's um, And that floss, I don't hardly change that now. I change that whoa, once every couple of months, really. It, it just takes, just stops all the big thick particles going through. And, uh, you know, there's just a, a still of it not not flowing there's all the four trays in place and you can see the spray bar at the top really easy done it's just on the outside of the pump a little bit of a panoramic view there here we go again that's with the four trays in and you can see if you look closely in the middle trays there's not that many holes in them so i, I just put a few in to start with and then fiddled with them at the bottom tray obviously there's no holes in the bottom of it i've got the four holes on the side there in the bottom tray I actually have gravel it all falls down the, the, the three bottom trays have got gravel in and the top tray has got a bit of gravel and uh, obviously the floss gravel and um, volcanic rock actually mixed together a bit of both <clears throat> really pleased with it really pleased it's, it's worked out a treat you know considering it didn't it cost me peanuts really There it is, filled up with me fishies, goldfish, fantails, nothing exciting. And there's me little mutts in the mirror there you can see in the window. 
my two staffies. I think that's oh Mika and Charlie, but I can't see who's who because they're uh, they're twin brother and sister. They're almost identical, apart from the essential equipment. <laughs> but yeah, really pleased with the result of it. Really pleased. I hope it's been useful for somebody anyway, the video. There's my lovely dogs. I still can't tell which is which. Yeah, thanks for watching anyway, because uh, I, just, I just thought I'd give everybody a go of a different idea of a backy shower. Really easy it was, I mean, really, really simple. You make everything to get the trays, then make everything to the size of the trays. There it is when it's starting to get dark a little bit on the evening. Put a temporary light in there just to fiddle with it. I've got much better lights in there now. Thanks for watching.